back again healthy living with Ms. Renee the barber in today's video we will be making Cajun smoked swordfish and we're gonna top that with a cilantro black bean and corn salsa if you're interested keep watching Thank you for stopping by my channel healthy living with Ms. Renee the barber if you are new to this channel welcome if you are returning thank you for staying with me on my journey now, let's go over those housekeeping rules don't forget if you haven't had that opportunity take the time right now go ahead hit that subscribe button hit that notification bell share comment and what always hit that like button at the end of this video, I will be dropping two in cards. You hit one of those in cards, it's gonna take you straight to another video of Healthy Living with Ms. Renee the Barber. However, to capture all of my videos, hit the post notification. Then you can choose when you wanna watch my videos. Now, you know this is a Healthy Living channel. We always start out with a squig of water. Do you have your water? If you do not have your water, it's okay. Go ahead, pause this video, go get your water. When you return, we will be here. All right, you got your water? Let's take that squid together. Ah. All right, so now I have a new kitchen gadget. This is the first time I'm using it. We are making a Cajun smoked swordfish. We're also gonna to top that swordfish with a delicious, cilantro, black bean, and corn salsa. Now, we're smoking indoors, in the kitchen. In the kitchen, all righty? Uh, normally, you know I'll pull out my big old uh, smoker from the garage, but if you don't feel like all that heavy lifting, or maybe it's in the winter time, or maybe you don't have a patio or a balcony to smoke, you can smoke on your stove top. So we're going to smoke, I have a little small mini stovetop smoker that we're gonna to use today. All right, now let's stop all this talking, right? Let's get started. We are going to need, of course, the star of the show, the swordfish. We're going to need corn, black beans, and there's a little bit of cilantro in here and tomato, but we're gonna add a little to it. So that's why we have a bunch of cilantro we're gonna need a red onion, jalapeno pepper, olive oil, tablespoon of garlic, Cajun seasoning. Now remember, no salt. Wood chips, a tomato, avocado, and lime juice. Non-stick spray. I'm gonna be using my chopper. You know what, you've seen that before. And you're gonna need your creative tools. And you will need a bowl to mix your salsa and when you're mixing your salsa be sure to use a clear bowl you know to make it more appealing and appetizing now this is the indoor stovetop smoker that we will be using today right. so let's look at our mini stovetop smoker it does have a top you can just slide it off and it does have a handle on the outside. It has a handle there for easy, easy pull and removal. This is the actual smoker box. This is the drip pan and the rack. Very simple. Let's get our swordfish prepared for the smoker box. All right, so for today's meal, I am going to prepare the smoker box. I have it preheated, and then we'll season the um, swordfish. 
and then place it in our smoker box, okay? So we're going to turn our um, burner on a medium heat. We are going to add our smoked chips, just about a tablespoon and a half. We're going to put it in the center of the smoke box in a small pile. We're going to place our drip pan on top, but before we do, we are going to put a piece of foil over the drip pan for easy cleanup. Then we're going to place it in the smoker box. Place it in the box right on top there. We're going to slide our cover on and allow it to heat. Now, let's get our swordfish ready. All right, so the Swordfish is kind of fatty, so we're going to make sure all the moisture is out. So we're going to pat it dry. And we're going to add some olive oil to it so that the Cajun seasoning will stick to it. We're going to add it to, we're going to massage it in. And we're going to add our Cajun seasoning. I'm going to flip it over, same on that side, I'm going to leave the skin on the swordfish, the skin, I'm going to leave that skin on the swordfish. You can remove it if you like. All right, that looks pretty good. It's seasoned on both sides. All right, so the chips that we're using for the smoker today are hickory chips, hickory chips. Now, we have our tray. We're gonna spray the tray with a non-stick spray. The good thing about the smoker is that you can use it on a gas or electric stove top. We're gonna place the swordfish on the tray. I can smell those chips already. going to drop Woo! yes honey we will allow it to smoke we're going to slide the tray on and allow it to smoke for just about an hour 7:30 We'll be back at 8.30. In the meantime, let's get ready to start on our salsa.
All right, so we're finished with the meal and now it's time for the taste test. Would you like to take a bite? Let me help you. Mmm, delicious. Really? Oh my goodness. Did you guys see that?
That looks good. All right, I'm gonna close out this video tonight. It's been a pleasure. Thank you for stopping by and sharing a portion of your evening with me. Now, if you haven't had an opportunity, go ahead. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I also want to remind you, I have a video that I recently dropped titled Zucchini Lasagna. Mm, that one is good as well. Alrighty, take a peek at that one. Until then, be safe, stay healthy. Here's the healthy living.